All right, hi guys. So I got this uh, GTX, really nice video card. Um, it was released in 2010. It's the first Fermi uh, model that uh, is supported by DirectX 12, and I'm really interested in opening it because uh, I have high temperature on the on the video card and uh, I want to play some Fallout seriously <laughs> and this is the the first card that uh, um, it's supporting DirectX 12 and I need to change the thermal compound because it reaches 100 degrees believe me 100 degrees and that's very hot for a video card um, The memory, the memory clock, if I recall, it's on 1.6, 1.6 gig. Let me see how I can open, open the video card. Maybe we can take the back panel off first. And then we have another screwdriver, so I can flip it. It got 600 megahertz on the core, quite nice. Oh, all right. Oh god, it's very dirty inside. Uh, I almost contacted the seller when I bought it on eBay. This is like I bought it for nearly 50 50 pounds the video card and um, holy smoke! Look at this. The heck is that? Oh god, no no, no wonder <laughs> it's overheating. Oh god. Alright, so let me see how I can take this cooler off. I need to unscrew something else. It needs to come off. This has got nothing else holding it. It's a very, very powerful video card. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it! I knew it will come off. It's a very powerful video card and uh, it actually runs really nice. This is an enthusiast level from this uh, 400 series, it's the most powerful 400 series video card. I need to go outside and clean this because uh, I'm not letting all the thingies. it four hundred series I got the four sixty C uh, GTX I don't think it's that powerful like this one but uh, I will open it and test it soon but first I need to go outside and clean this video card because it's uber dirty I got something for this type of problem an air dust an air dust bottle so I can clean everything and apply some new thermal compound on the chip again it's reaching does it come off? no it doesn't come off it reaches almost 100 degrees and that's embarrassing for a video card 100 degrees and yes it runs Fallout 4 because it's DirectX 12 compatible so this is the best card from 400 series if you want to go on Wikipedia I, that's how I bought it because I was checking which one is the best from 400 series and I saw this one was and I bought it and I'm really excited to put it on I actually saw how it's working it works really nice but um, I was shocked 
on temperature and I, I didn't know why it was overheating but now now I see it all right so I cleaned the, the fan I clean everything I use that compressed air you can actually see it's really nice now and rice and rice <laughs> nice and tight <laughs> everything is uh, back to normal and um, I need to apply some thermal compound on this chip I'm not selfish and I will give him a lot of thermal compound alright so the thermal pads that I think they are inside under this radiator, I don't want to touch them for the moment. Usually, people change them, but this video card is really nice. It's got a really nice design. You can actually see the uh, the coils for the video card. They are well ventilated, and the capacitor. You actually saw on the on the other video with the eight eight hundred with the capacitor, uh, they blew up. But on this case, you can actually see the the fan. It's got a nice uh, nice intake, and uh, I think it cools the, all the components around it, and very nice. And uh, no doubt, this is the best video card from 400 series. Think of it; it's. 2010 a 10 years old video card and it's running it's running fallout on medium but it's, it's on medium I tested it and it was running with uh, 40 60 frames per second and I think that's very impressive for a, a video card this old all right I think that's enough I'm not painting any walls here, so let's put back the fan. Some old thermal compound. Oh, this old thermal compound is so hard to take out from the from the rubber. I have an industrial rubber here, and it can sustain a lot of temperature. But it's so hard to take the the thermal compound out all right now we did we need to do this with a trick a really nice trick This is it. That's it. Apparently, that's it. You cannot see it, but it's there. All right, so the card is almost done. Or oh, this is the cover. I forgot to clean it, but next time it just needs to snap in. really nice and it's very easy to clean it so I hope 
you learn how to clean your video card because this is a really nice video card and uh, hope to see you next time with another video card maybe a <laughs> more unique video card or a much better video card like this one uh, I hope you enjoyed it I hope you learn how to take it out uh, how to clean it and uh, let's play with it let's play with it you know <laughs> see ya that's it bye